morning, grossies. Here we are with another Google Force 101. Sorry, I couldn't let my blunt go out, you know. Today, we're going to be talking about my nuts. You know, everybody likes to play with my nuts. You know, soap nuts. These things are magical. We've been preaching them for years now. And we got to give special credit and shout out to Collectimus Coop for plugging that little golden nugget of information into my brain. And it just took off from there. We use these soap nuts in almost like every corner of the garden. We, we literally put our nuts all over everything. So soap nuts, from what I understand, they come from a tree in the Himalayas, I'm going to say. Don't shoot me if I'm wrong there, but I'm pretty positive it comes from a tree there. The soap nuts that we use, they seem to be dried and processed. When a soap nut's fresh, it's actually uh, pretty soft. It's more uh, considered a soap berry over a soap nut. If you guys find that cool. So, and if you ever order soap nuts and they come and they're more like a berry, uh, I would send those back because I want to say a few years ago we had somebody that had issues with the, the actual berries and we've never had an issue with the soap nut itself. But on to what the soap nut does for us. This is our IPM. It is also so much more like yes we are spraying this is giving us the sapping effect just like using a soap or whatever but the soap nut itself actually has insecticidal properties too which is really cool so you're getting double bang for your buck and one of the sweetest things i found about soap nuts is you can spray them basically whenever you want like say you're sitting in your grow all day the stuff dries up you can just keep on spraying it because who cares if that gets into your soil that gets into your soil that's a saponin and it's just going to make your soil wetter it's going to candy coat nutrients for microbes it is just an all around good thing I've always ordered my soap nuts on Amazon I'm going to start trying to throw the Amazon links uh, in the description for these videos so I, I seen the comments down there uh, the past couple days. You guys asking where to get the sprayer and whatnot for the soap nuts. Throw all that in there for you. <clears throat> I think what else we talk about on the soap nuts? Oh, another thing that I really, really like to use them for is we have our wicking beds in the frugal forest. I like to just throw straight handfuls of them into there. It's pretty cool, and then uh, when you go to water them, especially when it's fresh, if it's around the area where you put in the water, you can get a real like sudsy bath and just foam the hell out of your wicking bed. It's a lot of fun. It doesn't hurt anything. Yeah, and as always, yes, it's IPM. Yes, it's super safe and all that. But do not spray this in flower. The minute you have bud sets. There, you can bring in predators, that's your only option, or you chop that shit down. Don't be one of those people. You know what I'm talking about. Other than that, have fun playing with your nuts, and may the frugal force be with you.